Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm doing this huge Dollar Tree haul. And when I say huge, I mean huge. Like, I bought like 30 things from the dollar store. I have this huge humongous bag. I have so much stuff in here to show you guys. And I'm super excited to be doing this video because the Dollar Tree has been stepping it up in the beauty section. I've been reading just a lot of reviews and stuff on their skincare products and also some of their makeup products. And they have a small elf section in the Dollar Store, so that's a plus. So Dollar Tree is definitely stepping it up and we're going to get right into this video, so let's get started. I'm basically going to pull things out of this bag randomly. My hair... My ponytail is like trying to play me right now. I'm gonna pull things out of the bag randomly because I don't think there's like a certain order. I'm gonna start with these sunglasses. I picked up these sunglasses. I thought they were cute and sometimes you just need to pop on a pair of sunglasses and they're just simple and really cute. I'm gonna try to get this off so that you can actually see what they look like. So this is what they really look like. And I just thought these were the cutest pair that I saw and I mean for a dollar I couldn't beat that and I needed a new pair of sunglasses to just keep in my car for when I'm driving or if I'm out and I forget my sunglasses at home that's just a good thing to have in the car. The next thing I got is this shower cap. So I have a bad habit of not wearing a shower cap. I just use like my nighttime scarf that I wear. But I bought this shower cap and it's a bonnet style shower cap it looks like this it's a cute little floral looking print and then on the inside it has like some cotton material and of course the outside is plastic so this is a dollar shower cap you can't beat that and i have a shower cap now so i don't have to wear my nighttime scarf and get it all wet before i go to sleep so the next thing i got is this phone case now of course this is just a dollar store phone case so it's not gonna do much protecting for your phone but i have the iphone 6 plus and i was surprised because i can never find a case for my phone in the store they just love the 6 but they forget about the 6 plus so i was excited when i saw that they actually had some 6 plus cases and purple is my favorite color so this is just a basic case when i saw this i thought maybe i could do like a DIY phone case video where I was doing like studs on it and making it really pretty because it was only a dollar so that's really affordable for you to get and do some cute stuff to it but it's not gonna provide that much support for your phone it's just basically a fashion case you know the cute cases don't protect your phone that much but this one is just basic so I picked it up so I was very interested to find that the dollar store actually has a full skincare line and when I say skincare line I mean like a three step skincare routine and this says it's the ultimate skincare system one two three and it lets you know on the bottle step one step two and step three. Step one is a facial cleanser and it says that it has shea butter, essential vitamins, and minerals. And then on the back it just gives you all of the information about the product and lets you know how to use it and also the ingredients. And then step two is a clarifying lotion. And this also says with shea butter, essential vitamins, and minerals. And of course it tells you how to use it on the bag and all of the ingredients and this refreshing exfoliating toner with super antioxidants bilberry coffee berry and rosa helps speed up cell turnover to remove dull and ashy looking skin dull and ashy looking skin okay we might we might need this we might need this It'll reveal newer, fresher looking skin and your skin will be more receptive to the next skincare step to fully absorb its benefits. So this is step two, which is prepping your skin for step three, which is the Youth Perfecting Intensive Moisturizer. Anything that says youth on it attracts a lot of people, me included, so I did want to give this a try. And this also says with shea butter, essential vitamins and minerals and it says that it's step three. So the dollar store has your $3 skincare line right here. And I'm excited to try these out. I have been reading some of the reviews just to see how some people feel about these products because I do have sensitive skin and you know how people think the dollar store and they think cheap, 
bad quality and expensive but they actually do have these thought out products like this and also some other skincare items that I'm going to mention next. I wanted to mention really quickly that I picked up these cotton rounds and there are 80 in here. Everybody uses these little cotton rounds for whatever reason but this I would use with the clarifying lotion. You know you can just pour this onto the little cotton pad and then you can just put that on your face. The directions say saturate cotton pad and gently smooth over entire face and throw and use twice daily. So if you get any kind of toning or clarifying lotion, you're most likely going to use that with a cotton round. So I picked up those. Oh, I really hate when my ponytail will be in the back trying to play me. So I pulled my hair up into this messy bun right here and we're just going to roll with that. So the next products that I'm going to mention look like they all go together but they don't have a specific order so I'm just going to talk about them one at a time. The first one is the oil free acne wash and it says for a cleaner clear complexion gentle yet effective treatment for acne problems. This is an acne wash and it says gentle so I'm hoping that it is gentle on your skin. I really don't have bad acne but I do break out sometimes so this says that it has salicylic acid and that is an acne treatment so you know once your skin is breaking out you want something a little bit stronger to use on your skin to fight that breakout so hopefully this is really gentle but still effective and the next thing that I got is the foaming acne scrub and it says just the same thing on the front of the bottle for a cleaner clearer complexion gentle yet effective and then of course it tells you everything on the back. The next thing I got is the anti-blemish cleanser and this one says for clear and smooth skin salicylic acid helps prevent and treat blemishes and this one is a cleanser so we have a wash, a scrub, a cleanser and we also have a deep cleaning mask which says draw out deep dwelling pore cloggers, shrink pores and reduce inflammation. So I'm guessing that all of these go together. The packaging looks the same and they kind of say the same thing on the front. These are four acne skincare products from the dollar store and I'm going to test these products out and let you guys know what I think about them. Hopefully these are going to be gentle on your skin and they're not going to break you out. I'm thinking about trying out these products and doing a huge review video for you guys just because I know a lot of people are curious about the things in the dollar store and their quality and if they're going to be good to your skin or not so I'm definitely going to think about doing that. So the next thing that I picked up is a face mask and it's a charcoal face mask and it says that it draws out dirt and impurities and clears pores and I've never tried a charcoal mask so I'm definitely excited about trying this. I don't really do masks on my skin but I hear that masks are really good for your skin and it's good to just clean everything out of your skin every once in a while especially if you wear a lot of makeup. So it says leave on for 10 to 15 minutes so I will probably put this on before I get in the shower so that I could just rinse it off while I'm in the shower and everything can just be clean at one time. The next thing that I got is this oil-free night moisturizer facial cream. It says that it's hypoallergenic with vitamin A and E. It enriches skin with intense moisture to leave it softer and smoother while relieving skin's dryness. So this is a night cream and it says hypoallergenic and vitamin A and E so that is what attracted me to this and it says to use nightly and smooth on face and neck until absorbed. It doesn't really have a scent to it. We're gonna see how this night cream works and if it makes your skin feel hydrated and refreshed and also softer and smoother so I will let you guys know what I think about that. The next thing that I got is a facial cleanser and makeup remover. This is a foaming face wash to gently remove makeup for soft clean skin and this is a cute bottle so of course when I see a cute bottle I'm like oh what's that? So this says massage a small amount on damp skin for 30 to 60 seconds and then rinse thoroughly with warm water. So this is just your typical facial cleanser but it's also saying that it can remove the makeup as well so we'll see how that works. I have the daily foot and heel cream which is rich long lasting cream to moisturize dry cracked heels and feet. I definitely want my feet to be softer. They're not dry or cracked, but to prevent any of that from happening, use a foot and heel cream to moisturize your skin. 
And everyone knows the trick to put on your lotion and then put your socks on and sleep in them so that when you wake up that your feet are extra soft. And the directions on this says massage a generous layer onto clean feet every day for deep moisturization. Slip cotton socks on and let the product soak in while you sleep. Not just a beauty hack, that's actually something that will help you. I'm going to put this on after I take a shower, right before I go to sleep, and I'm going to put my fuzzy socks on. I'm going to sleep with them and see if my feet feel extra, extra soft when I wake up the next morning. So the next thing I got is baby lotion. I love the smell of baby lotion, and baby lotion always makes my hands and skin feel so soft. So I picked this up because, of course, it was just a dollar. And baby lotion can be like expensive. It smells the same. It smells like regular baby lotion. I would try this if you were at the dollar store. The next thing I got is Jergens. I was surprised to see the brand Jergens at the dollar store, but this is the extra moisturizing hand wash and it cleans and moisturizes. It says that it's the classic cherry and almond scent. I didn't smell this when I was in the store. That smells really good. And this is just a hand wash, so it's gonna go in my bathroom, on the sink, for her, whoever to use. And I was just surprised to see this in the dollar store because I hadn't seen Jergens in the dollar store before. But I'm pretty sure I already know how that works because I've tried Jergens lotion and body washes, so I'm sure their hand wash is just as good. So I definitely got a lot of skincare products from the Dollar Tree because I really was shocked when I saw how many options there were. So the next product that I'm mentioning is also for skincare, and this is a face mask, and it's green tea. And it just says it's rejuvenating, and you wear it for 15 minutes, and I always see youtubers on snapchat with their face masks on talking about how soft their skin feels when they get done with it so i wanted to give this a try and it tells you how to use it you're just supposed to clean your face and then put the mask on and leave it on for 10 to 15 minutes and then peel it off slowly and then massage your skin because there's some excess product left on your skin and it's supposed to make your skin feel really soft and hydrated when you get done so I'm excited to try these and they also had a lot of different flavors. They had like green tea, pomegranate, blueberry. There were there were options, but I just wanted to try one because I've never tried them before. So I got the green tea one. I'll let you guys know what I think about this. The next two things I got were wipes. I got these makeup remover facial wipes and this says that it has vitamin E and there's 40 in here and they're soft and pre-moistened wipes. So hopefully their makeup wipes are tough because I use about two to three makeup wipes at a time. So if they're not as good as the normal ones, then that means I'm probably going to use four or five of these at a time. But we're going to see how they work and how thin or thick they are because that's really what's going to determine how much makeup they take off of your face. But the back says that this is the fastest and most effective way to clean face and eyes daily and that it has vitamin E so it's supposed to make your skin feel nice afterwards as well so we're gonna try those out and the other wipes that I got are exfoliating facial wipes and these say for sensitive skin and it says alcohol free fragrance free and wet cleansing so these are also pre moistened wipes and there's 30 wipes in here but these don't say that they remove makeup so that was why I picked up both of these because this one is saying that it removes makeup and this one is saying that it's for sensitive skin so I couldn't choose between the two. I'm not sure if these are going to be strong enough to clean makeup off of your face but it just says exfoliating facial wipe. It doesn't say anything about removing impurities from your skin or removing makeup so I'm guessing that these are just exfoliating wipes. I'm not sure how they work but I'm going to test them out to see what they're all about. I picked up both of these to try these out. I didn't get many makeup related products. I got two e.l.f. products and these are the e.l.f. Flawless Eyeshadows. And these are just their little quads with the eyeshadows. And it tells you where to put each shadow. So it's the easy four step guide to perfect eye makeup. So one says base, the other says lid, crease, and line. So you're supposed to go by what the colors say so that you can have your perfect eye if you don't know what to do with shadows this is going to be your friend 
Elf shadows are usually pretty okay with pigmentation. I've tried other elf shadows and other elf palettes, but I've never tried their little quads. But I got one in Beautiful Brown, so this is going to be a neutral eye for you. And then I got Sea Escape, which has blue and teal and some dark blue, so this is a more colorful look. But I'm going to try these out, and I have some new e.l.f. brushes as well to try. I haven't seen any e.l.f. brushes in the Dollar Tree, which is surprising because they're only a dollar for the $1 line of brushes that they have. So when they start having the brushes in the Dollar Tree, then that's one less store that I have to go to to get an e.l.f. brush. So the last two products that I have to mention to you guys are hair care products. I've only tried hair care products from the Dollar Tree once and that was the shampoo and conditioner and I really like them so I would repurchase those. But these interested me because it says personal care simply shea and they both have the same packaging and they both say with organic shea butter. This one is Deep Moisture Shampoo and it cleanses, moisturizes, and strengthens. And this is the Deep Conditioner and Co-Wash and it moisturizes and strengthens and can be used as a cleanser. So these reminded me of almost like Shea Moisture, like natural hair products because of the way it looks and saying simply Shea, I automatically thought of Shea Moisture. But I didn't know that the Dollar Tree had a section for natural hair and I did see one when I went this time and I just got these two because it was a shampoo and conditioner but they also had other natural hair products. I'm not natural so I didn't know anything about the other products so I just got what I knew which was the shampoo and conditioner but I thought that was really interesting. It smells so good. It, it just, it has like a sweet scent to it. It doesn't even smell like shea butter but it smells fruity almost. I would definitely pick this up if you're natural to see how it works on natural hair. I'm not going to be able to give you guys that update, but I'm going to let you know if this is a good shampoo and if this is a good deep conditioner if my hair is softer. It probably will make my hair smell really good because it smells so good. Yes, I'm so glad that I found this. I was finding things at the Dollar Tree that I had no clue that the Dollar Tree even sold, so it was just crazy so those are the last two products that I got from the Dollar Tree I was so excited when I made this purchase because I got so many things at one time and I've never bought that many beauty products from the Dollar Tree at one time so I hope that this video really helped you guys please give it a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it I did film this makeup look so I will have that video linked in the description down below if you want to check that out and don't forget to subscribe to my channel before you leave and I will see you guys in my next video bye